The OCC, Officer Candidate Course, that's only for college seniors and college graduates. Which is the preferred program for those that already have a degree but do not have uh, prior enlisted experience. Once they've completed their college degree, they provide that proof of college degree and they enter into that program, attend Officer Candidate School for 10 weeks, and receive their commission at the end of that program. Well, uh, went through UVA, uh, learned how to do the 9 to 5 job, uh, bolster the bottom line, and decided that's not for me. I tried a lot of different things. I, I went and worked a little bit. I went out to sea on my engineering license. All the while having that dream to, to, to do something more with my life, to make a difference. And I just felt like this was the challenge that I was looking for. I found out that uh, this is right for me and that uh, I'm very excited about pushing forward and being a Marine Corps officer. When I graduated Penn State, I was actually very eager to report to training. University Hayward. Emory Riddle, Aeronautical University. College of William and Mary. University of California, Berkeley. Yale University. Georgetown University. Fordham University in New York City. Starting off, we come in here just all a bunch of college students, and we each possess our own personalities and skills. It's a very challenging transition for most of them. It's a lot more intense than their laid-back college atmosphere. Everything is challenging, and it, it really tests you. It tests your discipline. It, it tests your desire to be here. My OSO had kind of briefed me on what it was going to be like, and I've talked to other candidates who had gone through previously. This has been harder than I can imagine, and to get through it is really rewarding. Couldn't ask for a better experience for the past 10 weeks, because it's, this is just the beginning of what's hopefully to come. A lot of good training and a good career in the United States Marine Corps.